Hello and Dobrigen from the eastern Slovak city of Košice. This being the middle of November, it was a rather bright but chilly day. And Košice railway station itself has all the usual amenities, including a brew pub, which I will admit I've never found. So where are we and where are we going to? Well this is Košice in the east of Slovakia and we are currently at the main railway station. The main railway station is in the east of the city near the old town. And we are going from Košice to the town of Humane which is further east. The railway station being pretty central the journey itself is about 97 kilometers, takes about an hour and a half and weaves itself around various stations and locations and mountains and hills and goodness and alone knows what else. I can't help wondering where the rest of the train has gone. Normally there are five carriages on this service. This particular service on the Sunday originates in Prague, or at least it should do under normal circumstances. This being lockdown season, and the border between Czech Republic and Slovakia firmly closed, it consists of two carriages and originated in the western city of Trebišov. I can't help thinking the fact that there can't have been too many people getting on a train at 4.30 in the morning from Trebišov to come to Košice, but you never know. Finding somewhere to sit is not going to be an issue. I counted 10 other people and they were all in the same carriage as me. So as all two carriages gently glide out of Košice railway station you can see that we left at 1 minute past 9 we've got four stops before we get to Humane at 10.33 At this point I would like to apologise profusely for not cleaning the window outside of where I was sitting. The line quality also out of Košice it leaves much to be desired and could do with a bit of love or at least an upgrade. The first station stop is the town of Trebišov. This is grain country. So as we approach, we're greeted by lines and lines of presumably empty grain hoppers. This is our second stop of Banovce. At one time, the trains from Košice to Humane would stop here and change to an electric loco. This is pretty much the extent of the electrification along this particular line. I'm guessing that at some point in the last 10 years, some bright spark decided to actually just stuff a diesel on from Košice to Humane, and it's knocked about 20 minutes off the overall journey.
Michalotse is our third stop. There's not much in Michalotse station other than loads of bright yellow Deutsche Post containers. But if nothing else, it's something different to look at. Travelling from Michalotse towards Humane, there must have been about three or four other people on the train at this point. Which brings us to our fourth and final station before Humane, which is Straski, which I'm probably pronouncing Yes, I am pronouncing it incorrectly. And following on from gratuitous close-up of Diesel Loco, there's the remains of Brekov Castle. Very pleasant day out. And now we approach Humane, which is DMU heaven. Or at least this is where they go to die, I think. Anyway, let's move on. In fact, there's rather a lot of rotting locos here. There's a lot more going on in Humane than in Koshitsa when I left. Humane acts as the main railway hub for the towns further east towards the Ukrainian and Polish borders. So as we bid farewell to our train, what's there to do in Humane? Well, um, on a Sunday not very much. The place itself is rather quiet on a Sunday and there's not much going on so the trains are the best things to see. The train journey has taken us an hour and 32 minutes, is a distance of 97 kilometers, and a rather bargain price of 5 euros and 30 cents one way. And before I get into trouble, yes, in the summer there's an awful lot more to do. Fantastic ice cream at a very reasonable price. 50 cents a scoop, I mean, flipping it, you go mad here. And whilst on a Sunday there's not much to do, you can venture up to the castle which is rather pleasant. Even on a Sunday, in the winter, and it was cold. Thank you for taking the time to get this far. If you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you all again soon.